Magic Nation, welcome to the 2020 Virtual Student Appreciation Day. My name is Krishana and I'm going to be your host for... How about us? Alright, we're going to be your hosts for today. This virtual event will feature a talent show full of dances, singing, and artwork. Also featured are virtual games hosted by SG, SAC, SLAM, and Music Council. You will get a chance to win e-gift cards from Amazon, Best Buy, Foot Locker, The Ultimate, and American Eagle, all by being the first, second, or third to send your answers to the specific emails. Not only that, but we have a special appearance by our very own FM alumni, from Olympic medalists and music producers. Before the show closes, we also have a surprise performance, so make sure to stay tuned till the very end. I know this school year has definitely been different and overwhelming. However, McGivney is known for making the best of all situations. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Before we begin, our grade 9 reps, Renee and Garen, will lead us in prayer. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Heavenly Father, as the end of the school year is coming right around the corner, we thank you for the protection you have provided for the teachers, staff, and students here at McGivney. Through our faith, we have managed to complete the school year facing many challenges throughout. We pray that you continue to give us strength to endure these times of hardship. We thank you for allowing us to provide the students with a student appreciation day that they deserve. For the students who have managed to conquer the new obstacles that were thrown at them during the school year. We thank you for giving us the strength to persevere and overcome the new circumstances that we are currently facing. Pray for the essential and frontline work risking their lives in order to protect us on a daily basis. May you provide them with strength and courage in times like these. We pray for those facing injustice, fighting for the rights that they deserve. May you provide them with wisdom and compassion. We pray for the teachers and staff who have provided us with the education and moral support we need throughout these times. May you provide them with peace and honor. We pray for the students, especially the graduating class of 2020. You have provided them with memories and experiences that are unimaginable. May you continue to nourish the friendships they have created and flourish into a world outside of McGivney. Venerable Michael McGivney, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, Renee and Garen. Now our wonderful admin team has a small message for all the McGivney students and the graduating class of 2020. Hello everyone, and welcome to Student Appreciation Day. Traditionally at McGivney, Student Appreciation Day has been an opportunity for us as a school community to come together in enjoyment and camaraderie to celebrate the end of the school year. As you know, this school year has been more challenging than in previous times, but the essence of Student Appreciation Day is still here as we gather together and celebrate the year that was. At this time, I'd like to thank our student leaders in student government and the teacher moderators, as well as the participants and performers who have brought this show together for you today. They've worked hard to put together a sense of community for us to round out our school year. And traditionally, Student Appreciation Day happens a little bit earlier in June. But since this is the final week of school, we'd like to wish all of our students a very happy and healthy and safe summer as we progress into the summer months. But there's a special group of students that we really do owe a message to, and that is our graduating grade 12 students. This has not been the end of school year that you would have wished for your grade 12 year. But I'd like to remind you, on behalf of our admin team, Mr. Chutzi, Ms. Anabali, and myself, that you have been cherished members of the FMM school community for the past four years. And the sum total of your experience at McGivney has not been the last few months, but an accumulation of events and stories and memories for the past four years. So as you progress into the next stage of your adventures and journey, please remember to reflect over the past four years, savor the memories, talk about the stories, and cherish the relationships that you have made as you move on 
And please remember that you will always be a part of the Magic Nation and part of the McGivney family. We wish you all the best to our grade 12s, to all of our students as you end this school year. Thanks everyone and have a great show. Moving on, we are now going to start our talent show segment. Let's look at all the talents that McGivney has to offer. To start us off, let's welcome to the screen Holy Ann Pena, singing Slow Motion by Karina Pajain. You've been calling me And I'm happy that we met Don't think that I'm not interested I'm just playing hard to get So much about this crazy game they call love that I'm trying to understand So won't you be my best friend Before you call yourself my man Why can't I love you in slow motion? That was amazing. Next up, dancing to Swish Swish by Katy Perry featuring Nicki Minaj, we have the very talented Karen Wang. They know what is what, but they don't know what is what. They know what is what, Young but money. they don't know what is what. They just strut. <laughs> what Yo. the fuck? Pink Ferragamo sliders on deck. Silly rap beef, just give me more checks. My life is a movie, I'm never offset. Me and my amigos, no, not offset. Swiss, switch, ah, oh, I got them upset. But my shooters, I make them dance like dubstep. Swiss, switch, ah, oh, my haters is upset. Cause I make them, they get much less. Don't be trying to double back, I already despise you yeah. All that fake love you've shown couldn't even disguise you Yeah, yeah Swish, swish, bish Another one in the basket What a performance! It looks like we have some really talented dancers here at McGivney because next up, with a classical dance mashup, we have Shamini Kamalanathan, Mary Mark Anthony, and Emma Massey. I hope that you guys have brushed up on your movie knowledge. Here's how it's gonna work. Emojis will be displayed on screen, and each sequence will represent a movie title. Remember, have all your responses typed up in one email and send it to the email right here. The first three people to send us the correct answers to our Gmail will receive a Foot Locker gift card. First place is $50, second place is $25, and third place is $15. Good luck, McGee. Hmm. What could it be?
Wow, great job, guys. Only a couple more to go. What could this mean? Thanks for playing. We hope all participants have now emailed their answers. Moving on, we have a message from a former FMM alumni. Next up, we have a few heartfelt messages from our very own FMM alumni. To kick things off, we have Felicia George. After graduating from FMM in 2005, Felicia George worked hard to earn her title as a Canadian track and field athlete at Bob Sutter. In her first Olympic game debut, she placed fifth in the 100 meter hurdle. At the 2018 Winter Olympic Games, she received a bronze medal for the two women bobsleigh event. Felicia George is an inspiration to everyone at McGivney for her hard work ethic and dedication. So without further ado, please welcome to the screen, Felicia George. Hey everyone, Felicia George here, Summer Winter Olympian, Olympic medalist. And I just wanted to come and send so much love to my FMM family. I know school has been canceled. You guys haven't been able to have the end of the school year that you typically would have. And I just wanted to let you guys know that there is possibility and uh, opportunity to learn in every single situation. I think about, you know, my journey towards becoming an Olympian and there were so many ups and downs, so many setbacks and so many things that I, at the time, really felt like was the end of the world. Um, but I, through every single setback, I've always learned something, gotten stronger and, um, you know, been able to see the silver lining in that. And so I just want to encourage you guys in this time to stay positive look for the possibilities and to remind you that absolutely no one and nothing can dull your magic. Stay safe guys, stay positive. Bye. Thanks Felicia. Coming up next, we have Jatine Raj on the piano playing Summer's Day by Joe Hishesh. Wow, that was so beautiful and soothing. Studio Ghibli music is just so good. 
Moving on, we have this beautiful choreography led by Simeon Pahumi performing a Bangra dance. Amazing singer. Next up, we have Melanie Chang performing History by One Direction. You gotta help me. I'm losing my mind. Keep giving the feeling you want to leave this all behind. I thought we were going to show. I thought we were holding on. I'll be the little teacher. This is school. Find a way to make it out of life. I thought we were going strong. I thought we were holding on. Oh, yeah. Whoa! They give me so much talent, it's crazy. Now, get excited for our next interactive game hosted by Music Council. Don't forget, me give me. There are three awesome prizes up for grabs. There are three $20 Ultimate Dining gift cards, so bring your A game. president of Music Council this year and we are very happy to lead you guys in a game for Student Appreciation Day. So the game is titled Finish the Lyric. So basically a Music Council representative will be telling you about some of your favorite songs and they will recite some lyrics for you. Now it's up to you guys to email us at mcgivneymusiccouncil at gmail.com with your answers. So make sure to sign your name and there will be a winner for each round. You will be playing three rounds and whoever gets the answer most correct will win a $20 e-gift card from The Ultimate. So good luck McGivney and here is your first round. Created in 1975, this song was produced by famous music group ABBA. The lyrics are, just one look and I can hear about ring. One more look and I forget everything. Do you know the lyrics? This slow, emotional, and powerful song was nominated Song of the Year at the Grammys and was the artist's most successful song this past year. The lyrics are, I guess I kind of like the way you numbed all the pain. Can you guys finish the lyrics? This next song is from the movie A Star Is Born, starring a famous female American singer. This powerful soundtrack ran on Billboard's Hot 100 for 45 weeks straight and won Best Pop Duo Performance in the 61st Grammy Awards. The lyrics are, I'm off the deep end, watch as I dive in. I'll never meet the ground. Can you finish the lyrics, McGivney?
And that concludes round one of Finnish Lyric. So how many songs did you guys recognize? If you didn't, don't worry, we have another round. So round two starts now. This next song is by a popular Canadian artist. The song was released in 2016 alongside his album called Views. It was named the 2016 Song of the Summer by Billboard, was streamed over 1 billion times, and sold over 2 million copies. Therefore, it is known as one of the best-selling songs of all time. Lyrics from the song are, Streets not safe, but I never run away, even when I'm away. So, McGivney, can you finish these lyrics? Hi, McGivney. The next song is a very, very popular collaboration between two amazing artists that I personally love. And it was also featured in a very popular movie that I'm sure we all love and cherish. Although, will you be able to guess the lyrics to the song they give me? Here are the lyrics. Then you're left in the dust, unless I step by it. Good luck! The next song is a 2011 song that many of us grew up listening to in car rides. The artist is known for his various music styles and stage presence at performances alongside with his 11 Grammy Awards. The lyrics are, Today I don't feel like doing anything. I just want to lay in my bed. Don't feel like picking up the phone. And now McGivney, it is your turn to finish the lyrics. that is all for round two. I hope you guys have been emailing us mcgivneymusiccouncil at gmail.com with all of your answers for a chance to win a gift card. So this is your last chance McGivney. Here is round three starting now. Hey McGivney, this next song was released in 2008 and has won a Grammy Award for Best Song of the Year in 2009. The artist is an American singer-songwriter that has made music from different genres, but this song is his most popular. It is a very catchy pop song that I'm sure everyone has heard of. Will you be able to finish the lyrics to his song? This is the first lyric. And nothing gonna stop me but divine intervention. I reckon it's against my turn to win some or learn some. Our second to last song is by a popular American singer-songwriter. Although he had a troubled past, he never gave up on his dreams. His music career launched with his first debut album back in 2017. Here's to one of his hit songs. Send me your location, let's focus on communicating cuz. All right, McGivney, can you guess the lyrics? Hey McGivney, we hope you've enjoyed our Finish the Lyric game so far. For our final song, we wanted to bring back something from a popular 2000s movie. Starring Demi Lovato and the Jonas Brothers, our final song is This Is Me from Disney's original Camp Rock. Can you finish the lyrics to This Is Real, This Is Me, I'm Exactly Where I'm Supposed To Be Now? Make sure to send your answers to Music Council's email. And from all of us, we wish you the best of luck and hope you had fun playing our game. So thank you all for playing Finish the Lyric. That concludes our game and we are looking forward to seeing who the winners are. That being said, from Music Council, we just wanted to say, please continue to stay safe and enjoy the rest of Student Appreciation Day. Moving on to our next FMM alumni is Jordan Romano. Jordan Romano is a Canadian professional major league baseball pitcher for the Toronto Blue Jays. He has worked tirelessly to achieve his goals and develop a reputation as an amazingly skillful player. With that said, let's welcome Jordan Romain. 
Hey, what's up guys? Jordan Romano here. Uh, I graduated FMM in 2011 and I'm currently playing with the Toronto Blue Jays. I just want to take time out and say uh, congratulations to class of 2020 on graduating. Um, you know, these are really tough times, but you guys did it, so you should be really proud of yourselves. Really excited for you guys' next chapter in life. So congrats again and stay safe. Thanks, Jordan. Speaking of talent, next up we have Kelsey Wang performing a dance to Wannabe by Ipsy. Next up, we have the song The Truth Untold by BTS, played on the piano by Lucia Evanchen. Let's welcome her to the screen. Next up in our angelic voice is Johanna Alilio, who will be performing the ethereal classic Halo by Beyonce. It's like I've been awakened, every rule I had you breaking, it's a risk that I'm taking, I ain't never gonna shut you out, everywhere I'm looking now, I'm surrounded by your embrace, baby I can see you're my saving grace You're everything I need and more It's written all over your face Baby, I can feel your halo Pray it won't fade away I can feel your halo Halo, halo I can see your halo Throwback songs always hit different. Get excited, McGivney. It's time for another game. We hope you've read up on your McGivney facts because next up, hosted by Slam, is FMM Trivia. It's Pranika and I hope you guys were having fun so far. Right now, on behalf of Slam, we are going to be hosting FMM Trivia. So, in the next few clips, you'll see a few members of Slam ask you some questions about FMM. So make sure you guys get your emails ready and type out your answers because you have the chance to win an American Eagle gift card. First place is $50, second place is $25, and third place is $15. So make sure you guys get ready and answer your questions and send them to the email that was mentioned.
Hey McGivney, here's your first trivia question. What is the name of our FMM mascot? This is question number two. How old is our school? Here's your third question to give me. Who are the valedictorians for the class of 2020? And here's trivia question number four to give me. How much does a cap cookie cost? And here's question five, McGivney. Who's the man behind the magic? Question number six. When did FMM open? Here's your seventh question. What staircase is the busiest between classes? Trivia question number eight. What time does the afternoon prayer come on? And now for question nine. Who was the student government president this year? Trivia question number 10 says, name one of the SLAM executives this year. So those are all the questions that we have for you guys today. Make sure you guys send the answers to this email. We hope that all the participants have emailed their answers. Moving on, we have a message from a former FMM student, Mike Zigomanis. Mike Zigomanis is a former Canadian professional hockey player. He graduated from McGivney as a class of 2000 and then went on to dedicate his life to playing hockey. Mike Zigomanis has played 134 career NHL games, scoring 19 goals and 14 assists for 30 points. Today, he works for Sportsnet 590, The Fan, where he co-hosts the morning show. His continuous dedication and passion for hockey is an inspiration to all McGivney students to embrace their own passions. Now, let's give a big welcome to Mike Zigomanis. Hi everyone at Father Mike McGivney. My name is Mike Zigomanis. I'm a former student. I'm currently a sports broadcaster on 590 The Fan, which is a Sportsnet Rogers network station. And let me tell you, these are crazy times we're all going through. I can't imagine being in high school and all the difficulties you're having with this, but hopefully you're using the time constructively, learning a new skill, cooking, picking up a new class, uh, whatever it is, reading a book you've, you've put off for some time. Hopefully you're taking advantage of this time and not just sitting home. I know the social distancing is very difficult and no one's really has ever been through this. They say in every difficulty there's an opportunity. So hopefully you're finding what that opportunity is. Um, for myself, as a broadcaster, I had no experience in sports broadcasting until a year and a half ago. So instead of going into work every day and just saying, well, I have nothing to talk about. No sports are on. I've watched other broadcasters. I've listened to other radio hits they've done on things I find um, to improve myself with and try to apply myself to to all these different mentors and, and people that I look up to. So there is opportunity even in these times where nothing's certain and it's it's really confusing for a lot of you so hopefully you're using it constructively um i can't think of a moment at father mike mcgivney that really stands out um but i am still friends with a handful of of other students and and guys and girls that i was um friends with back then i still talk to today and it's it's uh, really interesting so maybe reach out to all your friends or maybe somebody you know haven't had a chance to talk to and connect because you never know down the road um, when you'll you know need someone to lean on and and ask for help 
if anyone has any questions or wants to discuss anything, you can reach me. Uh, my DMs are open on Instagram at Mike Zygmanis. Follow me, send me a message. Hopefully I can, I can help you out. Um, but thanks a lot again for, for connecting here, um, through this virtual chat and, uh, hope everyone's hanging in there. Thanks and talk to you soon. Thanks, Mike. Now get ready to be blown away by Brianna Levy's contemporary dance combo to Elastic Heart by Sia. Wow, that was crazy good. I wish I could move like that. Now, send your attention to this beautiful dance to a Tamil song sent in by Ratisa Yutai Chandra. <laughs> Man, I would do anything to learn how to dance. Wait, McGivney, we have more talent. Get ready to be amazed by Nanditha Krishnan's painting, based off of Bob Ross's secluded bridge. That was satisfying. We really are a school of many gifts. It's so nice to see our FMM students showcase their talents. Once again, we are now going to play a game of sports charades hosted by SAP. Magic Nation, Amanda Benitez here, and welcome to Sports Terminology Trivia. SAC has a bunch of movements and skills that some of our McGivney athletes use during their games. All you have to do is guess the movement and send it to this email, and the top three winners can win an Amazon e-gift card starting from $50, $25, and $15. Good luck! So all you have to do is guess what kind of skill you think each of our SACers are going to be demonstrating, and then you win. Here's the first one. Make sure you have a list of all the answers on one email and send it right back to us. Hmm, what could this be? Don't worry, you got it. This one looks familiar. What could it be? This one looks familiar. Would you look at that? We got another skill up next. This one looks familiar. What could it be? This next movement is kind of hard to do, but it's when a player in ultimate frisbee jumps or dives for the disc on offense or defense. What could it be? 
You guys are good. We got more. This one looks familiar. This next action happens when the player positions his body against an opponent in a certain space on the floor between the opponent and the basket in order to secure a rebound. You hear our McGinney coaches yelling these two words at us all the time. What could it be? I've never seen any McGivney player use this in the game. What could it be? Did you get them all? Hurry, send them right to our email. Look out for more fun activities during the show and make sure to email us a full list of all the answers. Thank you for joining us. We hope you guys learned a little something new. Stay safe, everyone, and enjoy the show. We hope that all our participants have emailed their answers. Moving on, we have a special message from our former FMM alumni, Uchenna Ofoha. Uchenna Ofoha is a Canadian-Nigerian volleyball player that has a position as middle blocker. He graduated FMM in 2012 and continued his studies at Ryerson University and maintained his amazing volleyball skills. Today, Uchenna Ofoha has volleyball leagues all over the world, from Finland to Germany and soon to be Spain. He continues to get recognition as he establishes success across the globe. Uchenna's hard work and dedication to volleyball has been an inspiration to FMM. Now that being said, let's welcome Uchenna Ofoha to the screen. Hey FMM students, it's Uchenna Ofoha here. I just wanted to show some love on your Student Appreciation Day. Um, with all the uncertainty around COVID, uh, I wanted to remind you guys to stay in it and stay motivated towards your goals. Now, I remember being in your shoes, not knowing exactly how the future was gonna look, but still had the vision of where I wanted to be. And don't get me wrong, it was challenging and no one is perfect. But I embraced the challenge and I worked extremely hard. Now, one thing that really helped me to this day was making short and long-term goals. Some short-term goals included making a schedule that consists of one thing a day leading me to what I wanted to achieve. So whether that be working out, scouting other professionals, or simply getting the proper nutrition and rest. Um, some long-term goals included uh, professional sports or working as an engineer after my career. Now this led me to now play professional sports, doing what I love, traveling to different countries and experiencing different cultures. And the last thing I will add is to always be confident in yourself and your abilities to get things done and who you want to be. Now, if you guys have any questions or want to reach out or just simply uh, don't know where you want to go from here, feel free to reach out to me on Instagram, uh, underscore U-C-H dot E, and I'll be happy to help you guys. Thanks. See you. Thanks, you, China. Next up, let's welcome Baravi Vernu and Jalaika Martinez, who will be performing a beautiful duet rendition of Gracie Abraham. I miss you, I'm sorry. Nothing happened in the way I wanted. Every corner of this house is haunted. When I know you said the way my but I miss you. That was beautiful. Up next, let's welcome Sook to perform a beautiful Bhangra dance. Not, not, not. 
Crazy good. Now everyone, this is our final game for today. The theme will be throwback TV shows. Pictures of your favorite TV shows without the title will be displayed on screen. Have your email ready and list all of them out. Again, pay close attention and send all your responses in one email to this email above. Remember, the prizes are gift cards from Best Buy ranging from $50, $25, and $15. Good luck! We hope all the, all the participants have emailed their answers. Moving on, we have a message from a former FMM student, Andrew Burt. Andrew Burt Libert is a famous Canadian music producer. He graduated from FMM in 2005 where he discovered his love for creating music beats. He then went on to form the hip hop and R&B group, Bird and Keats. Andrew Burt has produced music for many popular artists. Some of the most notable being Cardinal Official, Meek Mill, Pusha T, Aesop Ferg, and French Montana. His music has been nominated for many Munch Music and Juno Awards. 
Everyone at FMM can agree that his strong work ethic and zeal for success is very inspiring. So without further ado, please welcome Andrew Bird. Hi guys, my name is Andrew Lybert, also known as Bird and Keys, and I'm a Father McGivney alumni class of 2004. Father McGivney has such a special place in my heart. I have so much long memories, um, lifelong friends, and uh, so many great teachers that help mold me and motivate me to this day. Um, I hope you guys cherish your time at school, cherish the relationships that you have, and uh, continue to be great. I know we're in tough times right now, but um, they're not gonna last forever, and you guys are our future. So go and be the best that you can, go in confidence, and follow through. Next up, let's welcome Sarah Mae Masenkai to the screen performing her lovely hula dance. That was amazing, Sarah May. Now we'll have a dance performance by Wing Lam Lau. Wow, that gave me the chills. Next up, we have Ashton and Yolanda performing Fly Me to the Moon.
Jane and Yolanda really know how to make great music. But wait, you thought that was the end? We actually have one more act left that we've been keeping a secret. Finally, last but not definitely the least, let's welcome to the screen our very own teacher band, composed of some of our favorite teachers, Mr. Carroza, Mr. Wu, Mr. Dito Massis, and Mr. Moncada. They call themselves the band name, and I quote, Mr. Dakaria presents the Moncada Magic Experience. So let's welcome them. This is a message from your three SG teacher advisors. We are so happy that you could join us tonight from your homes as we gather for one last time before we break for summer. We really hope that you are enjoying your student appreciation event. 
The student acts this evening have been very impressive and we appreciate the time and effort that was put into each and every submission. Thanks for bringing the magic, McGivney. The three of us were so excited to hear that SG wanted to continue with the tradition of a talent show for SAD during this unconventional finale to our school year. There would be no show without FMM students stepping up and allowing us in to see their hard work and talents. So naturally, we felt like it was our duty to not hold back and to showcase one of our many, 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 many numerous, countless, really unbelievable talents that we have. The apple doesn't fall far from the McGivney tree, that's for sure. So we have gone ahead and put together a compilation of our extraordinary dance moves for your enjoyment. This is our way of sharing in the magic, saying thank you to all the students who bring magic to McGivney every day. All right, let's not keep these awesome people waiting. I like to call this first move you're about to see the funky fan tune. Oh, this is real yeah, yeah. My, 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 my left stroke just went my uh, Sit uh, down. Uh, she said, do you love me? I tell her only partly. I only love my bed and my mom. I'm sorry. Just wow. I am more and more impressed every time we dance. That last move reminded me of a Beyonce move from her Formation World Tour. I'm really not sure why we weren't part of the FMM dance crew this year. We have an unbelievable, yet very believable, gift of dance. We hope you enjoyed our dance numbers, but on a serious note, this would not have been made possible without a number of individuals, so here we go. A special thank you to all of you who submitted acts for the show, to the clubs and councils who helped with the games, to the teachers and administrators who also contributed their time, their talents, and for supporting SG all year, and finally to our 2019-2020 student government for putting this all together. You have worked hard all year and have been so dedicated to planning events and being the voice at McGivney for your peers. You have accomplished a lot together and to those who are graduating, you have made us proud and we wish you the best of luck on your future endeavors. Thank you to all the students of FMM. Student Appreciation Day is a day for you. Thank you for keeping the magic alive. Have a safe and enjoyable summer, McGivney. Bye. Thank you. I'd like to give a special thanks to the performers from the video, um, the alumni who agreed to be part of the video, SG's teacher moderators, FMM's admin, all the other councils who collaborated with us, and most importantly, the students. So this is the 2019 to 2020 student government signing off. And that's it from us, McGivney. Have a great summer and remember to stay safe and stay positive.
Oh, I won't be afraid. Oh, I won't be afraid. Just as long as you stand, stand by me. So, Lord, Lord, stand by me. Just as long as you stand, stand by me. So Lord, Lord, stand by me.